Light to the Gentiles. I think that was one of the first uh, kind of biblical pieces that I ever attempted. Uh, the story is of Mary and Joseph, the baby Jesus. I think uh, this is when Jesus is 40 days old. It was the tradition that the firstborn in, uh, in the family would be dedicated to a life of service in the temple. Families could sort of get around that commitment by uh, going to the temple and making a ransom sacrifice. If you were prosperous, you might offer a sheep or a lamb. If you were under more humble circumstances, you could bring a dove or a pigeon. And Mary and Joseph, that's what they brought. So they, uh, in the painting, Joseph has a little wooden bird cage with a couple of doves in it. And uh, as they came into the temple grounds, there was a man, uh, Simeon, who had been coming regularly to the temple for years and years because early in his life he had been promised that somehow he would uh, see the, the promised Messiah in the flesh and he would go to the temple regularly praying that this promise would be fulfilled. And somehow on that day, he saw this ordinary looking little trio, father, mother, little baby, coming to the temple grounds and something told him that this was what he'd been waiting for. And so he approaches Mary and Joseph and then he basically takes the little baby Jesus in his arms and lifts him up and, and prophesies what would uh, befall him and his family. And, his upcoming life. There's also uh, a woman, Anna, she's seen in the background, an elderly woman, and, and she also uh, recognized this little baby as the promised Messiah.